Look here. You want to catch another center bounty hunter? Take a gander at the poster there. The Terror of Valentine. That one? They say she's sleeping rough near Cumberland Falls. And what's more, they say she ain't sleeping alone. Oh, I got it. We got enough crap around here from the livestock. Girl. Mr. Thomas Downs, you owe me money. Uh, oh no no, I'm I'm I'm. Oh, come here, you maggot! Please, sir, I'm. I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Uh, please, I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts, I'm I'm not running anywhere. I'm I'm I'm, do, I'm doing my best for you. If I'm here, there's a reason I'm here. You are a slippery little bastard, but I got you now. Please. <laughs> How's that dead looking now? You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money.
Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find something, too. He always does. Hold still! Well, you be Pearson well, said now, he's Mr. short Morgan. a little meat for the pie. I'm always Stop, well, Miss Grimshaw. This ain't funny. Oh, I disagree. Now, why are you so afraid of a pair of gelding tongs? <laughs> I thought you were the horse man first. That there's a bounty hunter. Get him! Hell yeah, no, I'm sorry, but I... No, I'm, I'm... Now stay there! Uh, 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 that dumb little uh, boy. Uh, oh, uh, Come here! Uh, uh, you are a piece of work. Now, come here. Rot in hell. Rot with the rest of them. Just isn't your day, is it? Don't you manhandle me!
You got a ride ahead of you. I need help, okay? I, I have an illness. A fever of the brain. I, I, I've done bad things, but a jail... A jail ain't where I belong. A sanatorium, maybe. Get me help, mister. Please? Save me. Save me from the sheriff. And moreover, from myself. I wish I'd cut your belly open. Be quiet with that. for now, you idiot. He had a redneck working out in this. We're coming up on the jailhouse. Anything else you want to try on me? Just get me there. You're no fun at all. I'm afraid I ain't. Did good, girl. You order a lady killer here, Sheriff? <laughs> yeah, we did. Put her in the cell, won't you? I, I protest my innocence. I protest my innocence. She might be a little shaken up. She lost another fella out by the falls. Poor dear. Men just got a habit of dying around you, don't they, Mrs. Swan? I hope you'll be comfortable, miss. She'll be fine. Now come get your money off the desk here. The Black Widow herself. This town's so starved of women, I'm sure she could find herself a husband yet. Well, that's cowboys for you. <laughs> Indeed. So it seems this town's got more pressing problems than outlaws. Gonna take some time off posting bounties, impose law and order on the streets. That man has a heart of stone. It's silly to keep me locked up in here. I mean, what am I gonna do? Just little old me. Let me out to exercise a little. I'm immune to your charms, Mrs. Swan. It's so boring in here. Can we have some fun, Sheriff? Just the two of us. And to think you were sniffing around this office at one point. I'm lucky you was charmed by another. You see, Sheriff, I know your secrets. And I could spread them all over. Like Miss Moria? Don't you dare mention Moria again. Now hush. 